question answer. So this is number four. Let's look at number five. We're on track to finish 10 questions today, which is awesome. So it says name the compound HNO3. HNO3. So it says name the compound HNO3. This is an aqueous solution, right? And this here, I have A here, which is hydrogen, nitrogen dioxide. C here is hydrogen nitrate. Oh, this, is, this is B, sorry. C here is nitric acid. D here is nitrous acid. So take a moment to think about this question. It says, what, what, is the, what is the compound HNO3, right? So HNO3 is, consists of uh, the, the um, so we have to first break it down into what, uh, we wanna break this down into uh, our two kind of elements here. So let's, let's break this down first and we'll look at our, our naming for, for this guy here. So when we look at our chemical formula, we have H and we have NO3 and we have AQ, right? So this is a big giveaway that this here is an acid, right? So this compound here is an acid. And why do we know it's an acid? The big giveaway is this aqueous solution here. And another big giveaway is there's a hydrogen in front of uh, the compound here. So these two, uh, more so like 99% of the time, states that this here is an acid. Um, and this here would be a, a, bi uh, a this here would be an oxy acid specifically. So this here is an example of an oxy acid. So how do we name an oxy acid knowing that? Well, knowing if it's oxy acid, A and B are definitely the wrong answers, right? Because I have an acid here. So it ha it's either C or D as our answer here. So I have, let me write this down in blue and I'll write down the oxy acid naming rules here. So we have HNO3. What we can do with HNO3 is what we can do is break this down into its, its, uh, its kind of, um, its uh, elements here, right? So we have H plus here, which is hydrogen here. And we have a polyatomic ion, which is NO3 minus, right? So this here is hydrogen. If we were to name this by itself, this is hydrogen. NO3 is nitrate, right? So this here was B here, but we know this is an acid. So this here is not, not its name. So this here is hydrogen and nitrate. And what we can do with this one is we want to follow how to name our oxy acids, right? So in order to name our oxy acids, what we do is we eliminate the hydrogen, right? We drop the hydrogen in its name. We drop the hydrogen in its name and we add acid to the, uh, to the, the, um, to the name after, right? So this here is nitrate acid. And then what we can do is we can drop the ATE here. We change the ATE here into IC or IC. So we change ATE into IC. So this compound here is nitric acid. So C here is our correct answer. Um, so this here, HNO3 is nitric acid. Now you might say, okay, what's nitrous acid then? Well, nitrous acid would be not HNO3, this would be HNO2, right? So if I had HNO2, for example, if I had HNO2, I would have a nitrous acid. And I'll show you why I have nitrous acid. So HNO2, again, is made up of H, which is the hydrogen, and it's not NO3 here, it's NO2, right? So it's not nitrate, but it's nitrite. So this is nitrite with the I-T-E. So in oxy acids, what we do is if we have an, if we ha have an acid like this, what we're gonna do with this, we're gonna, we drop the hydrogen, we add an acid, but if we have an I-T-A-E ending, we are going to change I-T-E here to us. So O-U-S here, O-U-S here. OUS. So this is nitrous acid. So nitrous acid is HNO2. Nitric acid is HNO3. So again, if I want to do um, ATE would become IC acid and the ITE would become US acid. That's kind of the rules for our oxy acids when we're naming oxy acids here. So here, this here, C is the correct answer. It's nitric acid. 
So answer, the name of the compound is option D, nitrous acid. So again, this solution here is wrong. The given compound contains a hydrogen and an oxy anion containing a non-metal nitrogen and an oxygen, which is nitrate. That's good. The given compound has an oxy and a nitrite. So they thought that HNO3 here is nitrite when in reality it's nitrate. Um, therefore, they wrote that as nitrous acid. So this solution is incorrect. Is incorrect. The correct name for HNO3 AQ is nitric acid because it contains hydrogen and nitrate. And because, and following, I'll say following oxy acid rules. Oxy acid naming rules. This compound would be named nitric acid. Eight becomes ick and add the acid. Or drop the hydrogen. It becomes ick and add the acid. So solution here is incorrect. Okay, 